Hey guys, what's up? Ellie Shadow Lady here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to set up a cool trap to prank your friends in Minecraft. This can actually be done in vanilla Minecraft, and it doesn't require any redstone, so it's really easy to do. Okay, so these are the items you're going to need. You're going to need sand, obviously, TNT, water, lily pads, a pressure plate, dirt, and a ladder. So the first thing you need to do is dig out a hole. I'm going to do this three by three, but you can make this as big as you want. And you're going to want the hole to be at least six blocks deep. And then on one side of this, you're going to have to dig down so that you can get to the area beneath the surface of the hole. So we want the sand to float on the top, but obviously that doesn't work with regular Minecraft mechanics, which makes the sand fall down. But there is a way to get around this. So four blocks down from the surface, you can do a layer of dirt here. And then you need to put a layer of water on top. So it should look like that. And then on top of the layer of water, you just need to place some lily pads. And then on top of the lily pads, you can place the sand, which should float like this. Now that isn't gonna do much as it is, so you need to go down here. And this is the important part. We need to replace the water with dirt, but don't break the lily pads. Because if you break the lily pads, this happens. So you don't want to do that. So we'll just put a lily pad back there. Sheep, please. Okay, what you actually need to do is replace the water, which um, doesn't affect the sand above it. And then you can delete this block. So you need to replace all of these blocks. And this should be getting rid of the water as well. So as you can see, the sand is floating. You can now get rid of these blocks here, which we place temporarily and there'll be a hole down there. Then all you need to do is put the TNT under like this and then cover up this hole that we made so that people can't see from the surface what's going on. And then the last thing to do is place the pressure plate on the center there. <laughs> is the pig gonna go on it? And oh my gosh, no, pig, please. <laughs> Wow, that was unfortunate. Well, anyway, you saw how it worked. I don't know how the pig somehow evaded it. That should not happen. So obviously, the bigger you make the sand area, the harder it is to avoid the falling and the dying. So another variation of this trap would be to build a similar trap, but instead of using TNT and a shallow pit, you dig a deeper pit so that if they fall down, they would die. And you put a lot of hoppers at the bottom of here to collect their items. So to use this trap, we're going to lure the player in, and to do that, we're going to have to add some incentive. So if you add a diamond block right here, and then set up the sand trap below it, I'm going to use world edit commands to replace the water, but you can just go down and dig it yourself. And now that diamond block is pretty tempting. So if someone was to come along and mine this diamond block, then they find themselves falling to their death, right into the hoppers, and losing all their stuff. So I hope you enjoyed this quick little video and I wish you the best of luck in trolling all of your friends. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and let me know how it goes when you troll your friends with this. Oh, whoa, look at Speedy Gonzalez over here. Oh, She's what? gone. Oh, what? There's different cobwebs this time. Oh, <laughs> 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 I didn't feel it. Did you sabotage me? Oh, sabotage. Oh, Joel did this to me. I didn't do anything.